Really? Was simple as all that? We are chapter eight. Hello, the internet Saffron here, back into Spirit of the North. And if you're wondering what happened at the end of the last episode, I'm gonna let you know you're not missing much. I managed to find the, I had to light up one rune to, to get a light to go out from the waterfall and then I walked for light ever. That's really all you missed. Um, so, that, so that was a thing. Uh, it just, it was just a little frustrating because if that was the way to go, that's fine, except then the door shouldn't have opened until like after I lit up the rune. I should have been just locked in that room so I wouldn't have been, you know, accidentally wandering around, which I did for like 10 minutes. But whatever, it's done, we're here now. We're in this, we're in this temple with the spirit fox. Hi. Yarf. Where, oh, where are we going? Are we going this way, friend? And this should be the last chapter. Oh, and I don't like, I don't know. All right, I was gonna say, I don't know why I'm even bothering going down there because I know there's nothing. <laughs> I absolutely know there's nothing now. All right, so yeah, so we have all the, uh, murals there, the red beam coming through the window, or the opening, I guess. Ooh, that's, that's pretty. That's, that's very pretty. Okay, where are we going, Mr. Fox? Mrs. Fox Fox? Where are we going, glowy fox? Get to follow it. Okay, more walking. Just, just more... Endless walking. Great. Apparently we're following it up this hill or mountain, as the case may be. I wish it walked just a little. Can we run or something? I'm going to just go ahead because I'm pretty sure that uh, I'm not going to get lost. Oh, but there's all this red and the, the vines and the yuckies up here. I'm not sneezing, though. No fox sneezing. Oh, there is a rift. And there's one sleeping here. There needs to be another. Okay. Oh, what happened? What? Oh, okay. Ooh. And that's what was creating the red swath. Why are you not focusing on me today, camera? Thank you. <laughs> the red swath across the sky. I don't know what's up with my camera lately. It's just decided that it doesn't want to focus. I mean, I know I'm not the most attractive person in the world, but you give me a little bit here. Work with me. Oh, now it's all pretty northern lights. We've reunited two foxes. Hi. Oh. Oh, look at that. So pretty. I can run across the sky. Oh, I'm supposed to be wagging my tail. Oh, oh, well, that was it. That is the ending. Chapter eight is a whole five minutes. <laughs> and I don't know. I mean, it was a good game. Like I said, the graphics are nice. I mean, they're not the best, uh, you know, but they're, they're good for what they are. I can't complain that 
I can't complain about that. And the environments were huge and they're just beautiful, but that was also a drawback because there just wasn't a lot in the environments. I mean, you sit there and you walk around and yeah, you're supposed to be looking for sticks, but you know, there's just certain times where there's just, there's absolutely nothing. You know, and that was just a little frustrating. And then the, although I didn't find a lot of bugs, the jumping, the fact that a lot of those jumps, I'm just like right there and you can't quite make them. So you have to do it over and over and over again. That was annoying too, very annoying. So overall, it's not, overall it wasn't a terrible game. I still enjoyed my time with it, but it wasn't great either. You know, there was just too many points where it was just frustrating. You know, especially the sequence break. <laughs> that I didn't even realize. And like I said, I wouldn't have been so insistent about it. Oh, whoops, did I hit an invisible wall there? Uh, anyway, but I wouldn't have been so insistent about that jump, except I made it like that. Like the second try, there I was on top of this thing. So it must be the way I have to go. <laughs> and it wasn't, and I still never did it the right way. I don't know. And then the one stick that disappeared, which again, they said that was a very rare bug. You know, so don't take that away from it because that's, you know, that's something that happens to me all the time. I accidentally break games. Hell, I had Shadow of Colossus crash on me. And even the other day, Pokemon Shield crashed on me. That's something from Nintendo. They don't have shit like that happen. It's just the way it is. Um, do I want to continue playing? What happens if I continue playing? Do I just run around forever? I mean, is there a point that I can just run around forever and then run into invisible walls? What happens if I go back to the mountain? Anything? Can I, I try to write my name in the lights, but it doesn't look like I can get like a top view, so it'd be kind of pointless. And I'm back here. Hi. <gasps> look at it, it's so pretty. It's pretty. Oh, and then if, oh, we'll see. So if I wrote anything, it'd just disappear anyway. So anyway, I guess, whoops, that's going to be it for this episode. I don't know what else there is to do. Uh, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you all later. Just run. Run forever.